Hi everyone. Uh, today I am going to discuss uh, how to create a library in SAS. So uh, before uh, <coughs> discussing how to create a library, so first of all we'll discuss what do we understand by the term library. So a library is like a physical uh, directory in SAS where you can store the SAS files or the data sets. So in uh, SAS Enterprise Guide. Uh, whatever you see on the screen it's like a front end so ultimately the data sets whatever you are going to create or whatever you are going to store that will be ultimately stored in the server so library is nothing but uh, creating a link to the server through the front end so the syntax is for creating a library in sas so you can see the server list window open here in case if it is closed you can just click on view tab so from there you get a option to open the server list so from the server list you can see the option called as server here so within server you have sas applications so in sas applications you have libraries and files so what you need to do is first create a folder within the server that is within the files so just right click on the files and create a new folder and give any name you can give any name you can give your own name as well so let us say i'm giving the folder name as smita and then press enter so it means whenever i create a file in sas i want to store it into my folder which is actually there in the server so to create a link between the folder within the server and sas so you have to write this command called as libname so libname is a command or a keyword in sas for creating user defined library so libname so next comes the library name so library name could be given as any name so library name is representing what is the name you want to display in the server list with what name you want to see the library name so any name can be given so let us say i'm giving the library name as test give a space and next is within the quotation mark you are supposed to give the path of the server that is the path of the folder which is ultimately there in the server so the path is and it should always be given within the quotation mark so start with slash forward slash so next is there is a common keyword called home so which is applicable for all the users so uh, this is the server path uh, which starts with home next will be slash so here you need to write the username so whatever is your username for accessing sas that has to be written so i'll write my user id that is sas user id again put a slash so next you need to write the folder so what is the name of the folder which you created here so the same folder name should be written over here in the path so this is the path of my folder which is present in the server so at the end put a semicolon so to execute this statement just highlight it and press the run button so let us wait till the statement is executed so in the log window you can see that it is saying library reference test was successfully assigned as follows so let us check out this library in the library section so just right click on the libraries and refresh
so now in the library section you can see that there is a new library called test created so whatever in future uh, the data sets which are getting saved in test folder will be saved here in the server so whatever the library you are creating it will be existing only for the current SAS session so every time when you close and uh, reopen you should always reactivate the library that is you have to always rerun the libname statement at the beginning of every SAS session in order to access all the files which are saved here so in simple term we can say that the library test what you have created is nothing but it is acting like a shortcut name referring the path of your server thank you so much for watching this video